Transportation Safety, Transportation Safety Board, uh, information yesterday. Um, not as much detail, I think, as some people expected, but basically what they have said, what they said was that they have moved their investigation from the track itself to the control room, and we have 92 control rooms throughout the system. They are currently testing um, the modules. Um, a module holds a lot of cards, and like circuit boards, that um, sort of translate or signals back and forth information to the, um, the sensors that are in the track itself. And they're testing that because as they track back what occurred on the 22nd of June, they have found some signals in the control room that are um, not correct. Uh, basically, the signal is not what the signal should be. And, and now, um, again, this does not mean it will not go back to the tracks, um, even though I have my, my thoughts on that. But now the focus is in the control room itself of the basic components. Um, that run the system. For the, the other information that we did uh, provide has been that we were in the process of replacing these modules. And in fact, we had a contract to replace 22. It was an $8.4 million contract. And we completed 10 of those and we had 12 more to go. One of the 12 was Fort Totten. And the, I'm not sure if that would have not have happened, had that have happened. Um, and we want to know until this investigation is completed. So it, it is a, a movement away from the tracks to the control. And they did say in their report that we um, recently, and when we did the upgrade of the impedance bonds, I think you heard about those things were in the tracks, um, you have to adjust these modules. And they went out of their way to emphasize these modules at 30 year, 30 plus year old pieces of equipment. And basically that's what they said. They are continuing to test those. They're working with my staff and they're working um, in our test laboratories to determine is there something specific within that that caused the accident. Um, when they receive something, um, they are the ones who will communicate it. And of course, they will let us know that evening, for an example, that a communications is coming out and 30 minutes later, you get it when we get it. 